lines of her ears and you twist it with a finger full of glue. Oh. Uh, my name's Ian. I'm a regular competitor at Rallycross. Uh, we've, uh, Blue Nose Autosport Club has been organizing Rallycross and in the HRM area for 12 or 13 years now, I guess it is. I started when the series started. It's a great, uh, it's a great way to get involved in rally sport. Uh, it's easy, affordable entry, uh, a lot of fun, a lot of great people. Um, and it's a good stepping stone if you're looking to get uh, more serious into rallying. Um, I myself, with my teammate Gordon Slay, we campaign a 2000 Subaru RS rally car in our local uh, performance rally series and for the rally cross we just have a basically a bone stock uh, 2002 Impreza wagon that um, that we have a lot of fun with uh, with not a huge amount of investment um, great way to practice your winter driving skills as well and know uh, exactly where you stand so a lot of fun great way to get involved and some days are actually warm unlike today We've, uh, We've had a, a good day today. It's, uh, there's a lot of fierce competition, a lot of people with uh, some pretty good driving talent here today. So it's a, an interesting tight course that got set up today. And uh, I like the challenge of it. It's, uh, it's, uh, it's pretty neat. Normally, Rallycross is fairly open if you compare it to like an auto slalom course that would be done on pavement in the summer. It's usually very open, very easy to see the lines. Uh, Greg Sweet, the course designer today, uh, and Patricia as well, they've put a lot of more technical features in it. It's a little bit tighter and twistier in sections, but it's got a pretty good flow to it. I, I'm really enjoying the course. It's just uh, an interesting challenge to get used to it, especially with the surface the way it is. It's probably minus 10 this morning, and there's a lot of ice under the gravel and uh, patches that are sheer ice, so you've got to be very, very careful with your braking zones and, uh, and getting the turn in, getting the car to do what you want to do. I haven't made glaring errors yet today. That could change, of course. The first run trying to see where the course went, where the course design is a little different, not quite as open as usual. That was a bit of a challenge. There are some fairly straight and open sections, and I think some of the more powerful cars have gotten advantage. You know, they can probably gain several seconds leaving the line. And, uh, and if you want to be really committed to it and, and and hang it all out there, maybe there is some time to be gained. I'm more of a, a cautious driver in, in trying to keep the car as straight as possible. Uh, it's not we're not at the pointy end today, but um, some days are better than others, and that's what uh, that's rallying, as Colin McRae would say. <laughs> 